Have you guys played seen The Swapper? I had a ton of fun playing that one, also a puzzle game. I've heard of it, and I actually think I, we might have it, because I think it was a PlayStation Plus... Ooh, gee, that's a scary glass door. I think it was a PlayStation Plus game, so I think we might have it. Oh, cool. Okay. My thinking is that the last puzzle to be done is this purple one mm. here, because, yeah, there's one more line, yeah. and it goes up into the center. Yeah. The relation between the controller and the control is reciprocal. The scientist in the laboratory studying the behavior of a pigeon assigns contingency and observes their fate. His apparatus exerts a conspicuous control on the pigeon, but we must not overlook the controller figure five of the game. The behavior of the pigeon has determined the design of the apparatus and the procedures in which it is used. Some such reciprocal control is characteristic of all science. As Francis Bacon put it, nature, to be commanded, must be obeyed. The scientist who designs a cyclotron is under the control of the particles he is studying. The behavior with which a parent controls his child, either aversively or through positive reinforcement, is shaped and maintained by the child's responses. The psychotherapist changes the behavior of his patient in ways which have been shaped and maintained by his success in changing that behavior. A government or religion prescribes and imposes sanctions selected by their effectiveness in controlling citizens or communities. An employer induces his employees to work industriously and carefully with wage systems determined by their effects on behavior. The classroom practices of the teacher are shaped and maintained by the effects on his students. In a very real sense, then, the slave controls the slave driver, the child, the parent, the patient, the therapist, the citizen, the government, the communicant, the priest, the employee, the employer, and the student, the teacher. B.F. Skinner, 1971. I think that needs to come further out because it's a four. Mm. All right, so we've got some more quotes. Okay, so we need to join. Because if that one comes straight out, it needs to be like a like a proper big triangle like that. Mm. Well, that's too many. It is. Oh, is it four and a four? Oh, I thought yeah. it was a three. Okay. Now it's a four and a four. Oh yeah, no, you got it. I do? Yep. Yeah. And it's go between the black and the white. Oh, yep. Oh, Done. brilliant. And then that opens up. The cup? Maybe there's another one somewhere. Maybe. So you see a purple wire snaking around. Oh, there's another one. Ah, uh, yeah. Two and three. Oh, no, excuse me. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, it is a two and a three. Okay. So. It's very hard to control at this angle. Mm. Can we just separate them all out from each other and just do a... Yeah, no, yeah. Up, up, right, right, right to the end. Right to the end. Yeah. Up, left. Here we go. Is that it? Yeah. Yay! Awesome, door open. Okay. All right, change the purple path. And now we go down lower. Okay, so. Have you played the swapper? Yeah, he said I had a ton of fun playing that one. Oh, all right. Cool. Missed that. Okay, so we need to go this way first. Oh, no, we need to go right again. We need to do the same thing it just did. Mm -hmm. 
And then we just... You don't need to go that far, but yeah. Now we go out the top. Nice! Cool! What kind of vibe does it have? Oh wow, what? What? Oh, hang on. No, we've been there before. For a second there, I thought that was like a whole new world. A whole new world. Hello. Nice. Atmosphere is very different from this one, but the puzzles are also very clever. Cool. Sounds good. Yeah, I'll have to give that one a go. I reckon. A whole new world. <laughs> Whole new fantastic Ooh. point of view. Something of it. Ooh. Oh, good. Flashing Yay. colors. I was I was just thinking I wish I had more epilepsy. This is... <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. Yeah. Um, I think that's right. Nice. Oh, my goodness, of course. Mm. Which ones are the actual blue ones? Oh, okay, it's those ones. So we go like this. No, we go... Like this, and I got this, and then like that, yeah, like that. It has a slight sinister atmosphere. Not sure how I describe it. Okay, <laughs> sinister. Cool. Okay, we got stars and flashes. So we need to make sure the stars aren't cut off. Almost okay. a little bit murder mystery type puzzles type thing. How do you do this? A little uh, bit of danger. How do you do this with the keeping the stars connected? Because this one needs to be connected with this one. Oh no, it doesn't necessarily. No, it doesn't necessarily. Unless that one can be connected with that middle one, because they both got yellow on them. Yeah. But they can't be in the same spot as those stars. No. Well, this one, this one, and this one can be together. And this one and this one can be together. But the stars need to be connected. But you don't need to pair those squares. Well, no, we don't need to. No, that's right. We need to separate them. Separate them. So go around the blue. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, you're right. Yeah. So how do we connect those stars? Well, you separate the top half and separate the bottom half. But yet that keeps the stars separate. Uh, we want the stars connected. This is the thing. Of course. Ha! Taco Gaming. Hey, Taco, how you doing? Oh, it's been ages. We've been seen you in a while. What's the point of this game? The point of this game is to complete the puzzles. I'll just, I'll, just, I'll just quickly jump out. So we've been exploring this island, and all over the island are all these puzzles. This is the island. And each area we complete the puzzles on shoots laser beams up into the top of this mountain. And so we're pretty sure we're near the end of the game. So we're now inside the mountain completing the last of the puzzles. And so each puzzle has the basic idea that you've got to make a line from the dot in the bottom left to the exit in the top right. But with different rules and, and difficulties. So the rules that we've figured out with this one is that the line can't separate the stars from each other. The stars have to be able to be connected to each other. Uh, but these different colored uh, squares have to be separated from each other. You can't have a yellow and a blue together. And they're throwing on top of it this m messed up color scheme thing just for funsies to make it extra hard for us. Oh, I think I know what we do. We have to have the yellow 
Uh, no, we'll go the other way around. So no, we can't go the other way around. We have the yellow together. Well, these two are definitely different in the bottom right corner. Yeah. Or we have the blue together. Hmm. How you doing, Taco? How have you been? Hmm. Thoughts, feelings, impressions? We've had ones like this before that I feel have to be impossible, but I know they, they can't be. <laughs> yeah. Um. <gasps> the suns are different colours. Oh, you're so right. They're not yellow. You're so right. So we need to connect a sun with a yellow, right? Yeah. And then... And then that sun with the bottom corner one. No, you... Oh, wait. No, you're right. Sorry, yeah. With this one? Like that? No, no. those are different colours. I meant the, the one in the bottom corner. Yeah. This one needs to be connected with the one on the top right. Yeah. Okay. So we lock that one off. And then... Although that might not work. I don't know how to do... I don't know how to do that. Mm. Unless you have to connect the top right corner sun with the blue... On the left. Uh, Bonquin says, the feeling of it being impossible. I think I've had that for every single one up until now. <laughs> Football got me in some pain, but I'm good. Ah. Oh. Did you, like a, a lingering injury? Did you get s smashed too hard? Did you pull something? I remember you telling us about your football. Okay, so maybe we connect that one with a different one. Maybe. I, I think we were on the right track. Oh, what if we connect that one with... Um, that one? No, you just tie it. Okay. Oh, we can't do that and then get back out again. No. Oh, unless we go the other way around. Okay. So, we connect these two. Yeah. Like this. And then we connect this yes. one with yes. that. Yes. yes. Well done. I've been having two practices each day. Each day. What? Gee, you must be representing at a really high level. Okay. That's awesome. Now I figure out the next one. So this Tetris piece, we have to make a shape around it to fit that shape. So for example, we could make this and see how that makes the Tetris shape around the little icon. But it doesn't have to be there specifically. We could have it here. As long as the Tetris shape is inside the... Yeah. But it looks like there's only two possible places for the Tetris shape. Yeah. And now we've got to figure out what color everything is because it's messing with my brain. I'm just going to throw some colors down and see what, uh, well, that didn't help. Speak okay, see you, Taco. Hopefully we'll see you around again. Taco had to go. Can't do that. Well, 
for that. Blue, pink, and green together. Oh, yeah. So I think, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this will never work. Right? Because it's cutting off the star. Yeah. It's just, are these well, the stars look like they're different colours. Yeah, but but even then, this this guy's got to be connected to something, right? Yeah. So we yeah. can't do that. Yeah. Which means the only other place for it to There's go one square down. is this. Yeah. So this needs to be done. Yeah. And then we need to somehow separate everything else. Yeah. But that green and pink would be. Well, I don't see how we can separate the green and the pink no. now that we've done this. And there's definitely no other Tetris pieces. And there's no other way to do the Tetris piece. Yeah. No, okay. We, we have to have something separating these. Yes. But if that was the case, then we would have to do... Do we know do which, which way around those other two go? No, because... The two, My the four in the middle. Yeah. There's got to be on. two. Taco said, oh, he said, never mind. Okay. No, sorry, go. You go. Oh. <laughs> the four in the middle, mm. there's got to be two and two. Yeah. Of the colours. Do we know which two on the right correspond to which two on the left? Is we it don't. Like the top two are but I, and the bottom two are I have a way of figuring it out. So if we do that, then if that green one flashes, then. Well. See, look, so this green one flashes, which means this one is not green. Okay. Which means that, that whatever okay. matches this is green. Yes, which oh, is sorry. the top right one. Sorry, it's pink. That yeah, one's pink. pink. Yeah. So these two are pink. Yes. Yeah. And, those and that's green, pink. And that's pink. And that's green. Yeah. So which means you can match the sun at the bottom with the bottom square. So these two can match up. Yeah. And then, so these two, these need to be separated like that. Is that yeah. right? Yeah. Oh, wait. Okay, go right, up, left, up, left, left. This could go wrong. Down, right, down, left. Oh, no. Yep. No, no. No, it still doesn't close off hmm. this guy on the right properly. Yeah. That pesky Tetris. I don't understand the Tetris. Because if he goes that way, do, do, does the, do, if the um, stars are matching up with one of these, does that mean it's okay for them to share a square? Like if one star oh, yeah. eliminates the pink and one, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh no, but these three have to be together. Mm. If we, if we have the Tetris shape like that. Yeah. But that Tetris shape is like the wrong I know, it would be like this. Yeah, which means that that pink still needs to be connected to a pink. So if we do that, there's no way that those three can't be connected to each other. What do you mean? Uh, these three in the middle. The left, the top left one, the top, uh, the bottom yeah, left one, and the bottom totally. right one. Mm. Okay, we've got a lot of help here. Come on, guys. We need ideas. How are we doing this? If anyone, if anyone doesn't know the basics, as in what... Symbol means what? Let me know and I'll repeat what each one does while we figure out. Mm. What did we establish? That that one is pink. Is pink. Yeah. Which means that one's pink. Yeah. Which means that one is pink. Yes. Okay. So what if we just eliminate this one altogether? Yeah. And then we pull this one aside. Yeah, try that. No. Bonkwin, sorry man, this disco stuff is too much for my brain cells. <laughs> Just unsure what to make of it. <laughs> oh, it's so true. Okay, we almost need to eliminate. So just so everyone's aware, so this one's pink, this one's green. 
This one is pink. Yeah. This one is pink. This one is pink. And the rest is green. And the rest is green. Does it matter that this is green? Does that make a difference? Can that connect with that? Like, does, does that satisfy that criteria? Unless that's another color altogether and it's orange. Because the Tetris have never been a different color, have they? They've always been orange. I feel like there was a time when they were a different color. Really? Hang on, I'm going to do it. Tell me if the star changes color. Uh, the, the one that I've got around in the Tetris block. All right, I'll try. It's uh, definitely flashing, right? Um, Much faster than usual. So by I normal it goes... I so. Not compared to some of the other ones. I don't know. There's too many colours. <laughs> I can't, yeah. can't focus. Because it would be great if we could tell if it was flashing, right? Because if we knew that, then we'd know if that's okay or not. And there's no glass that we can look through to... No. That's pink. As is that one. Digital Kid, welcome Digital Kid. Did you complete Treehouse? The rule is taught there. Yeah, we completed the Treehouse. We know the rule. We understand the rule of separating the colors out from each other. We're just getting so thrown off by it constantly changing colors here. So this is, we're inside the mountain. So we've completed everywhere else. We've got all 11 lasers. Um, so we're trying to get in this one. What you got for me, Vix? Nothing yet. What if we go? I'm just experimenting now. Yeah. Now, Digital Kid, are you saying that from a perspective of you know what to do and you're just waiting for us to do it? Or in the sense that, you know, you understand the general rules, but you're not sure how to... Oh, there we go. I did it. Oh. Couldn't tell you oh. how, but I did it. Great. And now we just got rainbows. rainbows. Oh, no, but we can see what colors they are. They're pretty clear, right? Pink, pink, yeah. pink, blue, blue, blue. Lots of yellows. So if we go, um, so I think let's try and catch all the blues. Oh no, that's not gonna work. No. Maybe can you go? Oh yeah, go go down, right, right, down. 
left, left, down. But then the yellows ah. are the same as the green. It's just one of those annoying ones where two of these colors actually turn out to be the same. I don't think so. What if we come at it from this side? Do, 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 do. No, pink and yellow. Oh, yeah. We've got to close that off. Do, 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 do. Yeah, there, yeah you go. there we go. That works. Well, that was much easier than the previous one. Woo! I'm beginning to think you're right that they've just used the actual concept art from the development of the game itself mm. and put it in, which is great, which is a cool idea. Oh, it's so beautiful. It is, hey? It really is. It's like, almost like going through an art gallery. I love it. It is. Okay. Uh, we're creating Ooh. more paths. One place to start. Lots of places to finish. Okay. And we've got to make sure the black and the white are separate. And we have some lovely pairs. That works, right? Yeah. yeah. So then if it takes us where we need to go, do we know where we need to go? Where we need to go? Beep, 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 beep. Fun seeing those behind the scene thingies. Yeah, it's cool, hey? All right. What are we missing? It can't be that easy. Huh. Okay. Ooh. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Oh. Okay, now I'm going to stand back and do this. I want to get as close as I can without being locked in. Okay. <laughs> this is so clever. That's so funny. Okay, we go like that, and we'll do that, and we will do that. Okay. So we need to start with a to the right to get around that pink one. Yep. And then do what you did. Uh, this is so cool. Oh, ah, those were not connected. Okay. I mean, so the, those were separated. Uh -uh. Okay. So we need to do it in a way that doesn't block those off. Mm. Um, uh, no. uh. So there's only one place that that three can go, the Tetris three. Well, it could go, um, one. oh, that one. Can't go anywhere else. Uh, can't. You've only got one spot. Oh, you're right. Yes. So it has to be going like this, right? Yeah. Well. Unless you join them together and flip. Yes. Like. So then we have the three, and then we have the it like coming out like this. Yeah. Yeah. Then you'd have to finish off. Oh, but we can't. Oh, no, we can do that. Yeah, so we'd have to, like, come up, hit that, and come back down again. Oop. And, oh, no, we need to... But we need to have the purple not locked off. Yeah. Oh, we can go down, and... Which way did it go? Like this. Hook. Yeah. Well done. Okay. All right. We want to roll. Now, before you do anything, mm -hmm. just just kind of compare. Do you want to write down that path, just so that we've got? I'll just take a photo. Yeah, so we've got it saved. In case we need to recreate. Okay, so if we did the same thing. Yeah. It is problematic because of that white and black in the middle. Yes. 
Oh, so we just need to add a kink. Yeah. Oop. We add a kink. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Very sensitive. Uh. Oh. Oh. And then that adds a two. Oh, of course it does. Okay. So. With a kink as well. Oh, uh, yes. But that won't work. Oh, will it? Yes, it will. But then this won't work coming back on itself. Because then we need to go left. Unless we reorganize. So that's the thing. That te Those Tetris pieces are the most variable. Yeah. We can do all sorts of things with them. Can we join all of these together somehow? No. No. Okay, so this guy... He either goes here yeah. or here. Yeah. Let's try it there. And let's play around with the Tetris a little more. Oh, that solves the last one and the first one, but not all those other ones in betwixt. Mm. Oh, that's cool. We can do like... Okay. So, there. Oh, what if we go around that way? Does that help us any? Wait a second. So, in this one, we need to connect this square with this square. Yeah. In this one, we need to connect this square with the next one. How did we do that one? Oh, that's right. We did it like this. And then we had a kink. Yeah. Oh, yes, that's right. We didn't connect them. We separated them. Yeah. Okay, so how can we modify this? Yes, we're gonna do. I feel like it's something to do with this top row because this top layer isn't really being used. Right, I was thinking, can we do the kink first? So we go right, 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 up around the black all the way to the left. Oh yeah, so right, 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 up around the black. Yeah, and then go up, right, up, up, left. And then we need to make this shape somehow. Yeah. That's going to separate those green. It is. Um. Hmm. Can you go around the green at the top? Like that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. And then... Yeah. Yeah. Yeah! Oh, wow. So the interesting thing is, all of them can be solved the same way. So if you f somehow figured out that way, you could just repeat it over and over and yeah. over again. That's very cool. Mm -hmm.